will talk about resource monitoring. If you are a data engineer without sufficient privileges, this topic might seem a bit unfamiliar. However, deleting your Snowflake account from accidentally incurring hundreds of dollars in charges overnight. Whenever a compute or a virtual warehouse is created, it is important to associate a resource monitor with the compute. And let me show you what do I mean by that. So this is my Snow Site Web UI, and I will execute the show warehouse command. And if I scroll right, here I can see something called resource monitor. And as of now, all the values are null. What does it mean that I do not have any resource monitor associated with my virtual warehouse? Now let me show you how you can create a resource monitor and ensure that each virtual warehouse is having an upper limit. So by chance, if the virtual warehouse is running forever with this resource monitor, we can really kill the virtual warehouse and save our cost. So for that, I can go to cost management and I can click on resource monitor. Now here it says that I do not have any resource monitor associated with this account. I need to make sure that I'm having an account admin role. So let me change it. Now when I click on the resource monitor, Let's say I would like to give a upper limit of 20 credit per day. So I can specify 20 and I can say this is a warehouse level resource monitor and I can choose as many virtual warehouses as possible at one go. And then I can click on customize and here instead of running it on a monthly basis, I can say my apply a daily limit and then I will put some actions. So the first says suspend immediately and notify when this percentage is crossed. So let's say that this is 100% and it says suspend and notify when this percentage of credit is used. So I can say 80%. The difference between first one and second one, here it will forcefully suspend all the queries. However, in this case, it will wait for the query to complete and then it will suspend all the virtual warehouses. And this is my additional notification. So I can click on that and I can say create my resource monitor. So now my resource monitor is created and here it says that there are so many virtual warehouses which are mapped to this resource monitor. Now if I go back to my and rerun this show warehouse, under this resource monitor, I can see this my resource monitor is associated and whenever any virtual warehouse crosses the credit limit of 20 in any given day, that virtual warehouse will be suspended automatically by Snowflake. And that way we can save a lot of cost. I already have a dedicated video on the resource monitor. And if you would like to understand more about it, I would request you to go and watch this video. I hope you got something valuable from this video. If you did, please hit the like button. Thanks for watching.